Well, so Carnegie Robotics uh, reached out to the CEO of the airport. They had already had this working relationship on some other tech they were doing. Um, and the CEO of, the, of Pittsburgh Airport, um, Christina Casota, she's really like, she's such an energetic, like mm-hmm. really the person you want in that job. So anyway, they connected with Carnegie Robotics and um, they had this idea to use UVC light. So it's a, it's on the spectrum. It's this sort of lesser known part of the UV light spectrum. And basically it's been shown to kill um, uh, other coronaviruses. So whether it's going to work against this coronavirus is still not clear, but they put the lights on the autonomous robots, cleaning robots at the airport. And so once it goes through its cleaning cycle, then it goes, it will uh, put the, apply the UV light um, and kill the virus. Now, potentially that it could be like a test model for other airports to use these robots and use these UV, UVC lights. And I actually was trying to, t- to talk to the CFO of Carnegie Robotics this story, but he was so busy because there was so much interest from other airports about the robot. So that's pretty cool. Um, I think it's just a cool story because it's like Pittsburghers figuring out how to do stuff. Mm-hmm. I always love to write those stories. And I think you know, it's, it's, it's similar to what they're doing in the New York City subway right now with the UV lights. It's that same principle, that same tech. So it will be very interesting to see in the next couple of weeks you know, um, if, if there's results there and if it's working because, you know, airports really need to encourage people that, hey, it's safe to fly. It's clean at the airport. But mm-hmm. I think everyone, it's going to be a little bit tough sell for a while. So this might be something to make people feel a little less nervous when they have to fly when things start opening back up. I, I appreciate this shot where the one guy's getting interviewed and it's like it's sneaking up behind him around the corner. Yeah. It's like, can I just, yeah. I want a gif of this later. <laughs> yeah. And they're like, you know, like some robots, I will say, like some of the Boston robotics, the one, the dog and the, oh. they, they, they're like comfy to watch them move. These robots are slow. Yes. Non-menacing. Yes. You know, yes. like uh, I'm not worried about it, like turning on me suddenly. So.